No, not chips or a candy bar. That comes after what you get out of this vending machine. I used it probably like four or five times. The voice of an anonymous customer and the one who took this viral video of how the marijuana vending machine works. He was selling like souvenirs. That's code, obviously. Machine took credit cards, even Apple Pay. It's an excellent service. I think that it just got out of hand. It's just things you can't do. That video there says it all. The feds, the ATF, they've seen it all. But a marijuana vending machine bolted to the side of someone's house on the west side of Detroit, that's a new one. Yeah, I have to say the brazenness of it um, was was shocking. Before this mugshot, 43-year-old Marcellus Cornwell was raking it in. Well, we were hearing the estimates were about $2,000 a day. Allegedly operating for four years. Entrepreneurial at its best. Unfortunately, both things were illegal. The both the ATF is referring to Cornwell being investigated for selling guns out of this house off Metatol Street, possibly to minors. 18 firearms seized from the home, including a sawed off shotgun. As far as where these firearms originated from and the crimes they might have been a part of, we're still looking into that. Business being too good, Cornwell's downfall. Look, you do this stuff inside a, a neighborhood, people are going to take notice and they're going to get mad. He's racking up a new felony charge on top of six other prior felony convictions. Reporting on Detroit's West Side, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.